According to NASA, there are more than 25,000 asteroids near us of 140 meters in size at a minimum. Additionally, there are plenty of other near-Earth objects that could be a threat to our planet. One of these goes by the name of Four Vesta, and it's so big that it can be seen in the night sky as if it was hovering nearby. Thousands of these asteroids can be found scattered across our entire solar system. The majority of them can be found in the main asteroid belt which is located between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter. NASA are constantly scanning the skies for near-Earth objects. These are small celestial bodies such as asteroids that could cause harm to the planet. Recently, NASA have announced this giant asteroid known as Psyche contains enough precious metals to make everyone on Earth a billionaire. The incredible statement was announced shortly before NASA said they're going to investigate the asteroid. It's over 140 miles in diameter, and can be found between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter. NASA hoped they'll be able to launch a mission in 2022. One of the main reasons to go here is of course because of the treasure it's holding. It's even caught the attention of private companies and space mining companies, and they hope to take a slice of the asteroid for themselves. Researchers have estimated it's worth over 10,000 quadrillion. This has also brought in people who want to invest in space mining. One person called Mitch Hunter said the following to BBC. Once you set up the infrastructure, then the possibilities are almost infinite. There's an astronomical amount of money to be made by those bold enough to rise to the challenge of the asteroid rush. Some, however, have called this move an economic impossibility. This is because the world's economy has a worth limit, meaning you can't just flood it with trillions of pounds worth of precious minerals. As you can imagine though people are not happy with this news, with some saying that before we go into the cosmos and deplete it of its resources, let's reflect on our own planet and what we're doing to it at the moment. Whereas others say we're running out of resources on this planet, and need to look for other options. So my question to you guys is do you think we should be going into space and mining for precious minerals? Or do you think we should be looking for alternatives on Earth? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.